there's an opportunity to sign up and find more out about the Declaration of Peace. There's a table over on my side to the right. Please check it out. We have got to increase these efforts. Now that we are majority sentiment in this country, our task is to convert that to political power and to change things. And to change things for the future. Now as we talk about peace, I'd like to ask our young people here what peace means to you. Anyone, what does peace mean to you? Love, happiness, and care for one another. Thank you. Freedom. Freedom. Having peace around the earth. Love shining in your heart. It's about people being nice to each other and not hurting each other, but being kind. Anyone else? What, what does peace mean to you? No more deaths. No more hitting. No more hitting, okay. Ending the war. Okay. Anyone else? Yes. It means having fun. Yes. yes, it means having fun. Yes. Love. All right. Nobody shooting. Nobody shooting. Thank you. Anyone else? You know, th this is so appropriate because, you know, as, as we talk about these issues tonight, and then we're, we're talking about nuclear proliferation. You know, nuclear weapons are still the greatest threat to us and our future and our children and their children. As we talk about the issues in, in Iraq and that justice and, and justice and the hundreds of thousands of folks who died and our troops. And now as we talk about the crisis in the Middle East, the job of Peace Action Wisconsin is so, so important. When it comes to working in the area of foreign policy, we're the only game in town. We're the only game in the state. Think about that. And we've kept this struggle going for 30 years now. 30 years. And over that time, we've had our victories. But now we're at a crucial point. A crucial point in terms of pushing on and changing things in this country. You know, there's good news and there's bad news. The bad news is it costs money. It costs money for us to do what we do, to operate the Peace Center, to lobby, to organize. That's the bad news. The good news is that there's money in your pockets right now. We need you. We need all of you. And for those of you who can be very, very generous, this is a special time and a special opportunity. Please be generous. We'd ask that everyone here do as much as you can to help us out tonight. We're gonna have money collectors going through the crowd. And yes, we do accept credit cards. And yes, we do accept pledges. But yes, we do need you. We all need you. We need you for their future and for the future of their children. So please be very generous. Thank you so much. Let's all together say peace and love. All right, one, two, three. Peace and love. Thank you. Thank you.